make sure you remember this information as for now and that's why I'm going to include this last part of the tutorial uh, which is setting up our configuration file um, because we're just going to put this information into our configuration file again that way we won't have to remember it. So let's set up all the information that we need to connect to our database. First is going to be our username um, and this is just setting up variables. You put a dollar sign and then whatever your variable name is. Uh, you don't have to say like string username or int username. You just put a dollar sign. PHP is pretty sweet like that. Um, so just go ahead and put username and then type in the username we just created which was Trav. Um, if you guys are reading the blog post it's going to be Travis but uh, the one we just created or I just created is Trav. Uh, the next thing that we want to do is have our password um, that we just created. Uh, again this is going to be bacon1 or whatever your password for that user was. Uh, the next thing that we want to do is set up um, where we're hosting our database. Um, so we're going to say dollar sign host and this is going to be localhost um, because it's going to be the same server that we're running these PHP scripts off of uh, if that makes sense. Whoops, that should be localhost, my bad. And then lastly our database name. So db name equals and this is going to be web service uh, actually again for this video series web service one um, but I'm just going to leave it at web service now that's pretty much all of our credentials in this tutorial I have no idea how long it is but it seems like it's getting long so the last thing I want you guys to do is just go to our blog post here and I have the code to actually connect to our database uh, with a bunch of comments um, so you guys can read through that as you can see here's the information that we just set up and right here um, each line pretty much has a, a good chunk of information about what it does so to save yourself time just go ahead and copy the clipboard and paste that within your configuration file and then go ahead and make your changes here um, to relate to that information you just set up. Make sure you guys kind of read through this. Um, all we're doing is adding a little bit of security, some options, and then we connect to our database. So anytime we use this config file and it starts session, which doesn't really apply to us, but anytime we include this config file, like if we went and saved this and then we uh, went into our index.php file and we said like include or require uh, config dot include dot php anytime we do something like this it's going to connect to our database for us um, so now we don't have to remember what our username is or our password or any of that information because we just include this configuration file and we're connected to our database we can alter things within our tables and all that information um, so again this is kind of confusing if you guys don't know anything about PHP and I actually got this configuration file from a different form I think it was a form post uh, on building a secure login you guys can check that out give him props because it's pretty sweet um, like I said this tutorial series isn't so much about security or PHP or MySQL it's more about the interaction so you guys might want to come check this form post out because it's got a lot of good stuff about building a simple and secure login uh, so you guys might want to check that out later um, but uh, anyways we're, we're taking that from him so thanks for that dude I appreciate it um, and we have set up our config file we have set up our database we have set up our user privileged user uh, now all we have to do is create some PHP scripts and our Android app so pretty awesome I know it's kind of boring going through some of this stuff especially because this tutorial is so long but I really do appreciate you guys watching this uh, checking out checking out sharing it and uh, we will see you in the next tutorial see you guys later peace